Welcome to Prayer and Coffee. In 1 Kings 19, Elijah went from a great victory on Mount Carmel to the depths of discouragement. Elijah went on alone, alone into the wilderness, traveling all day. He sat under a solitary broom tree and prayed that he might die. I have had enough, Lord, he said. Elijah was all alone in the wilderness. Over the past year and even into this present time, it seems so many of God's children have been cut off from the fellowship they need with the body of Christ. And discouragement, despair, and depression has set in. Elijah told God, I'm all alone and they seek my life. And for some of you, it's felt like that, like no one cares and you're facing a mountain of problems all alone. Hebrews 13, God has said, I will never fail you. I will never abandon you. So we can say with confidence, the Lord is my helper. So I will have no fear. What can mere people do to me? And at least here at Community Haven, we're praying for those who... Um, are a part of our church family. We miss you when you're not with us and you are in our hearts and prayers. We are upholding you in our prayers. Praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Spirit, being watchful to this end with all perseverance and supplication for all the saints. We have not ceased to pray for you. We always pray for you. We are. We're praying for you for your health, for your spiritual being. We're upholding you in our prayers. So let's pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Father, we are still in this flesh and without you, we're not strong enough. We need your strength, your Holy Spirit. Lord, so many of your children have been cut off, isolated by this crazy pandemic and by fears and by life's situations. And Lord, some have been cut off from the body of Christ by Satan. And some have drifted off by themselves like Elijah. Our Father, we need those that you have placed in our lives. People who pray for us and with us when we're weak and when we're down and when we can't see because of the mountain in our way. Jesus, help us to understand that we need one another, that we're stronger together, that there is protection and covering when the church prays for one another. Father, in these unusual times, these isolating times, cut off from the help we need, shine your light into our hearts and help us to see the protection and provision that you have made for us in the body of Christ, his church. Help us to pray for one another. And Father, bless and strengthen those we are praying for. In Jesus' name, amen.